This instructional video was developed to help working groups successfully author documents in the IEEE Standards Association Microsoft Word template. Video 1 showed you how to begin by filling in the required information fields. This video illustrates how to insert content for a new standard into the template. The template is updated frequently. Please make sure when starting a new standard that you have the most recent template. To begin authoring your standard, copy and paste the scope from the PAR into subclause 1.1 of the template. If you have included a purpose on your PAR, copy and paste it into subclause 1.2 of the template. To format the body text, highlight it, go to the Add-ins tab, and click on Body Text. The body text should be justified 10 point times New Roman. Clause 2 lists normative references, which are documents that contain material that must be understood and used to implement the standard. List them in alphanumerical order, including the designation and title. Each document in the list of normative references must also be cited normatively within the text of your standard. The definitions clause, introductory text, and footnote are part of the template and shall not be altered. After entering the text of your definitions, highlight the text, then go to the Add-ins tab in the template menu. Select Definitions, set change numbering for terms, then click the Save and Format button to have Word alphabetize and correctly format the definitions. It is easy to create headings and subheads in the Word template. Just go to the Add-ins tab in the menu and click H1 for a first level header. For a second level subhead, click H2. For a third level subhead, click H3, and so on. First level headers are 12 point Arial bold, second level subheads are 11 point Arial bold, and third level subheads are 10 point Arial bold. Adding informative notes can be done by selecting Insert Special Note or Notes from the Add-ins tab. One note will enter a single note, multiple notes will number a series of notes. Footnotes can also be added through the Insert Special pull-down menu. Just select Footnotes and a footnote number will appear within the text where your cursor is and a place to enter the footnote text will appear at the bottom of that page. Footnote numbers will automatically sequence themselves numerically. There are two types of lists you can create, dash lists and numbered lists. To create a dash list, go to the add-ins menu and click list dash. An indented dash will appear and you can begin typing your text. Hit enter to create the next dash. A numbered list can also be created from the add-ins menu. Select numbered list then Start New List. An A will appear within the body text and you can begin typing. Hit Enter to create the next lettered item. To create a second level within the list, choose List Level 2 from the Numbered List pull-down menu. Remember to always save your document as a dot .doc. See the next video on adding figures and tables in the Microsoft Word template.